Construction on the North Spokane Corridor started in 2001. It's supposed to be done by 2029. Under Governor Jay Inslee's original proposed budget, that finish date would have been pushed back to 2035. Since December, the budget's been changed to include funding for a timely completion. On Monday, the House voted to approve this new budget. Our Bronte Sarotsky joins us live from the still unfinished North Spokane Corridor and spoke with lawmakers about the next steps needed to finish the project. Well, with the House's approval of this updated budget, this corridor could be done by 2029 rather than the additional six years that it would have taken under Governor Inslee's original budget. I think it's an essential project for moving people, uh, cutting down on emissions, reducing travel time, putting people to work with hard hats and helmets, and uh, largely for our economy. Eastern Washington lawmakers, Spokane County, and city officials have been speaking out against Governor Inslee's original budget proposal, which would delay the completion of the North Spokane Corridor by six years. On Monday, the House voted to approve an updated transportation budget that includes funding to complete the freeway by 2029. Definitely feel that excitement and want to keep the project moving. On Wednesday, the Senate will take its vote. Our Senate budget and the House budget are identical on the North Spokane corridor. So, you know, both uh, House and Senate are committed to keeping the project on track, um, continuing to make progress and not, uh, you know, pausing at any point, but just sort of keep the keep the contractors going, keep the work going. If the Senate approves this budget, it'll go to conference committee. It's kind of a smaller group that meets to iron out the differences, bring back, a, you know, for lack of a better word, a compromise proposal that uh, everybody can support. While more still needs to happen now that the House has approved this budget, local lawmakers see it as the first major step to get this project done. That was started prior to me being born, uh, which is kind of uh, actually insane. It's time to get it done. And lawmakers have until April 23rd to get this funding approved. Reporting live in Spokane, Bronte Sarotsky, 4 News Now.